you know there's something new called awake craniotomy it's been there for quite some time i think we are awareness among people is not very uh, very much at large but uh, why awake craniotomy see when you can give anesthesia and do surgery why do you want to make the patient awake while doing surgery the indications for this kind of surgery is if in case the patient has a tumor in the eloquent areas eloquent meaning the most vital areas like the the speech areas where the hand areas the motor functions leg areas the face and all those uh, areas and the tumor is located adjacent to it you need to map and stimulate and map the brain while doing the surgery so we keep the patient sometimes under local anesthesia we do a small mini craniotomy we use the navigation or guided surgery to resect these tumors and uh, continuously monitoring the patient while you can talk to the patient and see whether he is able to move the hands and move the legs and he can speak and all these things can be possible only with awake craniotomy for this for awake craniotomy the patient also has to be very cooperative in an uncooperative patients we can't do an awake craniotomy at the same time there are other things like brain mapping where that will be useful to do this kind of uh, surgeries